Hi there, welcome to H2E Pods, where we specialize in the healing health benefits of one specific molecule, molecular hydrogen. It's one of the smallest, it is the smallest uh, element in the universe. It's the most abundant element in the universe. And it can be in so many different forms. When you look at hydrogen, you can have it in water, you can have it um, as steam, you can have it as ice. Um, the, the, the body is made of um, a huge, well, around 60% of water H2O. And when you understand that this one specific molecule, when it's in a different form, it acts as an incredible antioxidant, mopping up oxidative stress and another harmful free radical called the hydroxyl radical. And I'm holding this glass of water because this is where hydrogen comes from. This glass of water is H2O, hydrogen and oxygen, and it's in the perfect ratio. So in our hydrogen machines, for example, we use something called a trolley list trolysis that splits well it puts a, um, a specific electrical charge inside the water that releases the bond of the hydrogen with the oxygen and when that bond's released you have something called hydrogen and oxygen gas the hydrogen gas has this sort of fancy name called molecular hydrogen but in short it's hydrogen gas and oxygen gas and it's in a perfect ratio two to one two hydrogen, one oxygen. And they work, when you understand how well they work together, it's f f f fascinating. So in hospitals in China and Japan, when COVID was on and people were struggling with breathing, they didn't give them just pure um, oxygen, they gave them a mix of hydrogen and oxygen because there's a waste product. Whenever you're having, um, anything, whether it's hormone production, energy production, fighting a virus, there's always a waste. It's oxidative stress or hydroxyl radical. And then the waste of that, that virus would go onto a red blood cell and it would fill the surface up so much that the oxygen couldn't land. And they work together. Hydrogen comes along and says, look, I'm your buddy oxygen. I'm going to clean this red blood cell, oxygen lands. And this is why hydrogen and oxygen are best friends and they work really well together. And there are, like, I've been in this field now professionally for seven years and it fascinates me that all the time there's new developments. At the moment, um, Spanish uh, there's a Spanish hospital researching the benefits of hydrogen therapy with autism. And they, they haven't found, okay, it's going to get rid of autism. But what they have found is that it calms the brain. So they're looking at ways of, we know retinal, retinal calms the brain of autism. We know CBD calms it, but there's always slight side effects. But with hydrogen, they're having a similar effect to CBD, but without the side effect, which is was fascinating. And there's so many things that hydrogen therapy can help with, whether it's your brain health. Um, if there's, if your brain is, you're doing a lot of um, cognition work, whether you're overstressed, your brain will be flooded with oxidative stress, which is the byproduct of working all of this stuff out. And with hydrogen, it cross, because it's so small, it crosses the blood brain barrier really easily. So it, it enhances uh, the, the cells, it protects the cells. And there's so many studies with hydrogen therapy helping with people with um, depression, anxiety, mental health issues, suicide, but that's like a, a whole different category, another category. But when you realize that everything is affected by oxidative stress, that's why there are 1,335 medical scientific papers on hydrogen on all these different fields because yeah it can help with longevity and anti-aging and reducing wrinkles because it's getting rid of the oxidative stress it can help with athletes because athletes you know make o oxidative stress for breakfast because they're using up so much energy and 
all of that byproduct is oxidative stress and oxidization is what erodes the cell. But when they work together, you get the clearing up of the hydrogen and then you get the energy of oxygen and they, they work hand in hand. So, um, you know, hydrogen and oxygen therapy can also work as an adjacent therapy for cancer. Um, ox um, cancer cells don't like oxygen and there's all this oxidization where the hydrogen works in. So it's like, it's incredible how many things it can help with. In short, hydrogen is called a reducing agent and it means that it reduces oxidization. But unlike other antioxidants, there will be a limit. So if you take so much vitamin C, there will be a limit where the body's overburdened with it. But yet with hydrogen therapy, there is no um, over reduced rate. So that you can take hydrogen therapy and if there is any excess, um, it, it's just excreted it's, uh, through the, the pores or it doesn't cause any trouble. So after learning all the benefits of hydrogen, it's like, then the, the next question is, well, how, how do I, if I'm a, a customer or I want to find out what is the best hydrogen for myself, this was the next question. And we went on the journey the last seven years working out well, what's the best hydrogen machines, how, and, and now we've got fantastic hydrogen machines. They're easy to work, um, the control panels are really nice. And we found out that the minimum therapeutic dose for hydrogen is 150 mils. But when we started using 150 mils, yes, it gave some benefits. But what we found was anything above 500 mils gave much better results. So all our machines are 500 mils and above. And you might say, well, why do I, if I have a, we have 500 mil machines, 1000 mil machines, 1500 machines, 3000 mil machines. You might say, well, maybe I just use it for a longer time, the, the lower amount machine. But what we found was that professional athletes or someone dealing with a really chronic health issue, when you're breathing in or breathing in hydrogen and oxygen at a higher amount, the saturation in the body increases. And sometimes, um, depending on what you're dealing with, or you need a higher saturation. So on our resource page, goes into more detail why you need a higher strength of machine for, a, you know, if you're a professional athlete or dealing with a health issue, or you're just dealing with general health. And we've worked out what machine suits uh, the person best. And then on top of that, over the years of doing this, we thought, we found out that protocols were needed because some people were saying, well, I'm going on this and I can just go on it for hours. Um, but we found that small amounts, little and often, gave for better results. And when you've got a chronic health issue, although there is an um, uh, over-reduced rate with hydrogen, if a body is over, has over-toxicity in it and you're going on a very strong, strong machine, like a 3000 mil machine, then the liver and the kidney will be overburdened. And what we're trying to do is slow, gentle healing processes. And that's why we've even, we were one of the first people in the world to do hydrogen trackers. So we're also not only working on protocols, but we're working on how to track progress and, and look into things. So we really care about our clients and care about getting the, the best results. So our, our best, some of our best equipment are hydrogen oxygen machines. That's what we um, recommend the most. And then we have a hydrogen water machine and we also do carbon 60 because on carbon 60 is almost like a supplement of hydrogen because 
carbon 60 is a, a carbon molecule with 60 shaped with a 60 sphere shape like a soccer ball but attaching to this soccer ball is up to 60 hydrogen molecules and this is where again hydrogen and oxygen are best friends and also carbon 60 and hydrogen are best friends they work together both have very similar diff uh, properties um, and give very similar results and we've we, we me and Andy who I, I work with H2E we say what are the very best hydrogen products and we've just said this carbon 60 the hydrogen water and the hydrogen oxygen gas and it's like we've really got something and it's like so fundamental to health it, it the, the more I understand this field it's like yes hydrogen oxygen isn't the, the magic cure for everything and and but it's a really important part of a puzzle and when you know how to put the bits of a puzzle together it's really fascinating and because I've been on on a long journey myself I got diagnosed with ulcerative colitis when I was 14 and at 35 years old I had cancer of the large intestine I also have a, a blog called Tony's treasure map to my, my best health hacks and in that will be a shortcut for anyone starting on this health journey and want to go I, I want to know how to stack things together because once you stack things together hydrogen is fantastic at reducing this harmful free radicals and you do this other thing it's like wow and one of my favorite quotes is when you've got good health you can have a thousand small problems when you have bad health you have one problem and it really stuck with me that because I count my lucky stars that I've got a thousand little problems oh, I've got a little problem with the washing machine uh, I've got to pay for school bill I've got a um, this and that you know thousand little problems I'm blessed with them thank goodness you know I've come from all of that thing and I'm not in that position where I ha I've got that one one problem and I'm, I'm passionate about the best of mainstream medicine, natural medicine, and to stay healthy. And that's our passion at H2E. And this sort of gives you an oversight of hydrogen therapy. And uh, please check out our science page, our, our blog page, and all the rest. And we're here to help. If you're interested in hydrogen therapy, without doubt, you're in one of the best places. Cheers, guys.